Hello, George. Good evening. Hello, George. Good How are you? Good evening, George. Good to see you. Me too. Good to see you. Yeah, are you tired? Did you have to travel today? No. The, today, uh, I am here in my home. Ah, you are. You didn't have to travel, or yes? Yes. No, no. Today, no. Oh, today. How many days a week do you travel? Um, five or six years, six days for a week. Oh, that's a lot, right? Yes. But do you travel by bus or by car? Um, by car. Oh, by car. Okay, that, that is kind of, let's say, tired, right? Because in the case that you have to drive? Yeah, uh, drive on, along in the old country, <laughs> but Mm -hmm. uh, I see the landscape, beautiful landscape, mm -hmm. uh, and yes. I know I know the other other side, other, other cities, other places. other other places. Yes, uh, other uh, places, right? Yes. Yeah, I guess you might know maybe most of most of the parts. What What is your favorite part from El Salvador? Uh, the your favorite uh, my place. Favorite, my favorite. Place is Chalate. Why Chalate? Why? Um, the clima, the weather, the weather, the weather is very fresh, and mm -hmm. the uh, the beautiful landscape is, is relaxed. The place. Yes, that that is that is the best part, right? That like yeah. to see all the mountains, the weather. The landscapes too, right? Yeah, un, un día. ¿Cómo se dice un día? One day. <laughs> one, one day. <laughs> one day, <laughs> okay. one day uh, visit the Entrepinos. This is uh -huh. the open. It's wonderful. Okay, yeah, I, I imagine that it must be beautiful, right? And yeah. uh, there is it there, there you, you, you will find only nature things or what else? Or what? is that a restaurant or what? Ah, the restaurant is the in the in the mm -hmm. and inside is the garden. The garden is the travel for the other people, but mm -hmm. the you know the cascada, cascada. There is a waterfall. A waterfall, okay, and the campus field. Okay, the land. The okay. Yeah. Okay, that's great. Maybe you can share some days, some right? Yeah. And, uh, in that case, we can travel there. Yeah. <laughs> okay, thank you, George, for sharing. So, good evening, everybody. So, hope you are having that your day was great and that we are in the middle of the week. We are almost finishing, guys, the English classes. We just have only one week left. And then this is going to be over, guys. It's almost. So keep working. So I'm going to pass the attendance, guys. And uh, whenever you listen your name, don't forget to say present. Hey, Amilcar, are you there, Amilcar? No. Okay, let's see. Uh, Angela Alejandra? No. Uh, Carlos Ademir? Carlos Ademir? Carlos Ademir, no? Present, teacher, present. Okay, Carlos Ademir, right? Okay, let's see. Daily, Lisset. Daily, Lisset. Daily? Okay, let's see. Eloisa Beatriz, Eloisa Beatriz. Let's see. Hugo Alexander Castro, Hugo Alexander Castro. Hugo Ernesto Ayala, Hugo Ernesto Ayala. Jennifer Noemi. Present. Okay, thank you. Uh, Jessica Beverly, Jessica Beverly. Okay, let's see, Jorge Elvir. Jorge Elvir. Present. Okay, Jose Naum Palacios, Jose Naum Palacios. Jose Naum, no. 
Okay, let's see uh, Mabel Hernandez. Mabel Hernandez. Uh, Maria Melina. Maria Melina. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Naum Hernandez Asensio. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Naum Hernandez Asensio. Don't you have a second name now? Do you have a second name now? Uh, teacher, when I when I born that my father my father was was strong, you know, and my mother said that he he forgot my my second name. Your second. That's, that's why I I have only one. Okay, but but, that, but it's but good, right? Yeah, it is different, right? Yes. Okay, and that I get, for example, a student which last name, whose last name is Miguel. Su apellido es Miguel. Eh, y yo siempre, le, siempre lo, lo, lo molesto, que, que si es el apellido o es el nombre, pero es el apellido, Miguel. It's okay. very strange. Yes, it is, but it happens, right? It happens. Yeah. Okay, uh, Nancy, 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 no, okay, let's see, Oscar Armando, Oscar Armando, no, Silvana Beatriz, Silvana Beatriz, good evening, teacher, good evening, Silvana, let's see, Vanessa Oded, Vanessa Oded, present, teacher, okay, thank you, Vanessa, Walter Santos, Walter, Present teacher, present. Okay. Good to see you, Walter. Let's see uh, Jairo Vladimir. Jairo Vladimir. No. And uh, Linda Vanessa. Linda Vanessa, Linda Vanessa, no? Okay. Okay, guys. Okay. I'm here. Okay, Amilcar, right? Okay. Yes, I got it. Is there somebody, guys, that uh, I didn't mention? Okay, okay, got it, Jennifer, got it. Let's see, Jessica Beverly. Jessica Beverly, okay. Jessica Beverly, I got it. Jessica, okay, Jessica, thank you. Okay, let's see. Is there somebody that I didn't know uh, and that was not here, guys? Is there somebody? Nancy? Nancy, let me check. Okay, Nancy, Nancy, are you there, Nancy? Hello, hello. Nancy? Okay, let's see, Nancy. Oh, okay, thank you, Nancy. Let's see, alguien más, guys, que se me haya escapado, no? Okay, perfect, guys. So let's start the class. And uh, yesterday we were discussing about the simple present and the present progressive difference. What is the difference? What is the diferencia, Jessica Beverly? Cuando usamos el simple present y cuando utilizamos the simple, the present progressive? When do we use? The simple present and the present progressive. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, Beverly, you are driving, right? Okay, let's see. Um, now, tell us, please. When do we use each tense? Okay, I'm going to share with you that, mm -hmm. that I understand that. Mm -hmm. so, well, we use the, the present progressive when you, when you are doing something. Like at this moment we are we are studying English, and mm -hmm. um, that or maybe that thing that will 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 have to do. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, tomorrow I am going to work, or maybe uh, you I'm are working. going to. Uh -huh, you are you are you are working. Tomorrow. Uh, uh -huh, tomorrow. And the other then the simple person that the daily daily routine that mm -hmm. or thing that I do. Mm -hmm. 
that maybe, for example, that she works in a bank mm -hmm. and, and he, he reads the newspaper. Mm -hmm. Yes. And, and, like, and he is a doctor, maybe. Yes, like daily routines, professions, uh -huh. right? Or, or, or thing that, but, but you said that the things that are true. Yes, general truths, right? Okay, uh -huh. yes, that's another and, thing. And there are a, a lot of examples about that. Yes, there are several examples, okay? Uh -huh. and, and the and the structure that you have to, when you are talking about uh, mm -hmm. present policy, you have to use the subject mm -hmm. plus uh, to, to be, mm -hmm. to be there and the, and the and the bear had to had to be in the gerund mm -hmm. ing. Excellent, that's right. Okay, thank you. Okay. Perfect explanation. Now, thank you so much. Okay, yes, mainly we were discussing about the difference, right? Okay, don't forget, guys, that today is going to be the date of Jennifer Noemi Aragon. Okay, so Jennifer, uh, you're gonna stay here after after uh, the class right okay so here we have the topic guys for today okay thank you jennifer and uh today we're going to discuss the present continuous but we're going to use wh questions so that is going to be the topic for today okay but first guys let's try to remember to re recall some of the tenses that we have studied. Okay, so for that, I will ask a volunteer to uh, do the first, uh, to describe the first activity. Do I have volunteers today, guys? Okay, vamos a hacer la siguiente actividad para que podamos repasar so we can review, guys, the topics that we have studied. Okay, do I have volunteers, guys, today? Okay, let's do something. Let's do something, guys. I'm gonna write a name here in my in my little notebook here. And if you guess the number, guys, you're going to be the one in the first one in participating. Okay. So give me a number from one to ten, Amilcar. Eight. Okay, no, you are not. Let's see, Silvana, give me a number from one to 10, except eight. Four. Okay, no. Okay, let's see, Naum, give me a number from one to 10, except four and eight. One. Okay, you are safe, Jennifer. Give me a number from one to 10, except one, four, and eight. Eight. No, you don't have to say eight. Porque ya lo, ya lo, ya lo tomaron, oh, Okay. Sorry, uh -huh. sorry. Uh, repeat, please. Okay. The numbers. Okay, los números que no podemos elegir son eight, four, and one. Two. Okay, María Emelina, you're safe, Jennifer. Okay, María Emelina. Okay, un número from one to 10, except one, four, I think it was two and eight. Okay, uh, um, nine. Nine, you are safe, Emelina, you are safe today. <laughs> okay, let's see, Margot, Margot. Margot. Yes, six. Okay, yes. six, you say six, Margot? Yes. Okay, Marcos, you are lucky porque no es usted. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Carlos, vaya, Carlos, los números que quedan son el cuatro, number four, five, seven, and ten. ¿Cuál de esos números, Carlos? Seven. Seven, you are safe, Carlos. <inaudible> Salvo, Carlos. Okay, let's see, Walter, Walter. A number, please. Tenemos, um, we have four, five, and ten. Six. Six? Four. Or four? Four. Okay, four, ya, ya lo tomaron. Six. Ya lo tomaron. 
odd que otro, Walter. Five. Five. Ok, yes, Walter. Usted es el premiado, Walter. Congratulations. Ok, Walter, let's go with the nice. first one. Ok, you are going to talk about your daily routines. Ok, daily routines. Tell us about your daily routine, Walter. Eh, teacher, eh, perdón, pero eh, como ayer no me conecté, como que ando todavía medio en la luna. Eh, ¿Voy a decirle cuál es mi rutina o cómo? Yes, sí, su rutina, su rutina, básicamente, yes. Eh, my routine is um, uh, go to work uh -huh. at 8 o'clock a.m. Uh -huh. And open the world, open the world. Mm -hmm. I I call clients. Okay. And in the morning, mm -hmm. in the morning, I write report in the and in the computer computer computer. Mm -hmm. uh, Present, present report my boss mm -hmm. and, and I I drink I drink coffee mm -hmm. at three o'clock mm -hmm. five five o'clock go to my house mm -hmm. and and. and uh, I I have I have class the English mm -hmm. uh, at a a o'clock mm -hmm. in at night mm -hmm. at night every every day and only that. Okay, very good, Walter. Very good. Solo tengamos cuidado, Walter, con los sujetos, verdad? Siempre hay que decir I I open. Okay. The doors of my work. Okay. Okay, okay teacher. Excellent. Choose the next person, please. Choose the next person. Choose the next person, please. Mm -hmm. Walter, ¿quién va a ser la siguiente? ¿Quién va a ser el siguiente, Walter? Mm -hmm. um, vamos a ver. Let me see. Yes. Uh, mm. Silvana Martinez. <laughs> okay, Silvana. Hello, Silvana. Are you ready? Más o menos. <laughs> Más o menos. So, so, okay. But that, that, the second one is easy. What is huh? the person doing, Silvana? Hello? What is, yes, hello. Okay, thank you, Walter. Okay, Silvana, tell us, please. What is... Hey, sí, hola, hola, Walter, ¿me escucha? Hola. Hola, Walter. Hola, sí, se escucha, Walter, no hay problema. Ok, vamos, Silvana, let's go, Silvana. What is the person doing? He's a, uh, he is a man and uh, he is uh, working in the street with a dog. Yes, very good. He is walking on the street with his dog or he's taking his dog for a walk. Okay, very good. Thank you, Silvana. The next person, please. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Maria and Melina. Okay, Emelina, let's go with the number three. What do you do in summer? What do you do in summer, Emelina? Um, we're going to vacation. Mm -hmm. and you usually go to vacation, okay? We, we do... Some things you don't usually do mm -hmm. when when you have to work. Yeah. Yes, like um, clean the house mm -hmm. and 
prepare the garden. Mm -hmm. and, um, that's it. Okay, okay, that's it. Okay, for example, you fix your garden, let's say, you clean the house, you do all the chores you have to do at home, okay? Very good, yeah. Emelina. Choose the next okay. person, please. The last one. Uh, let's see who are there. Um, Alejandra Ostorga. Alejandra, hello, Alejandra. Hello, teacher. Me acabo de conectar. No, no sé qué están haciendo. Ahorita solo estamos respondiendo las preguntas, eh, Alejandra. Okay, no sé si nos puede ayudar con la picture four. What is he doing? Um, what is he doing? Uh, he is. Perdón. He is. He is. ¿Qué está haciendo él? What is he doing? He is. Uh, He's check the. He is mm -hmm, checking the computer, right? The computer. Uh -huh. Or the emails, right? Okay. okay. Very good. Very good. Thank you. Okay, guys, let's continue. And uh, we're going to have a quiz, guys, for you to review, right, these topics. And uh, for that, I will ask you to go to the following link. Vamos a ir al siguiente enlace, guys, para que ustedes puedan tener este juego, okay? Give me just a moment. Okay, me indican si lo podemos ver en el chat, guys, please. Let's see. Okay, let's see. And uh, now I'm gonna share with you the code. Me indican si podemos verlo, guys, please. Ahí está. Ok, ahí está el código. Ok, let's see. Tengo a I got Naum. Thank you, Naum. Ok, Silvana, Jennifer, too. Jessica. Okay, todavía, guys, somos, we are today 15. Okay, thank you, Alejandra, for confirming. Somos 15, guys, 15. See how many we are? I don't have, sure. the, I don't have the link, teacher. It is in the, in the, in the Zoom chat, Emelina. In the Zoom. Yes, in this chat, the Zoom chat. I'm sorry. Okay, no problem. Let's see, guys. Okay, I'm gonna share it, no problem. The link, so you can have it in both groups, right? There you have. Let's see, guys, we are nine, six persons are missing, guys, six persons. Okay, Walter, got it, Walter. Okay, you're welcome, Emelina. Five more, guys, five more. Let's see. Okay, guys. Okay, no more, guys. Okay, I'm gonna start. Voy a empezar entonces, guys con el juego. Ok, let's... Ok, Carlos, I got it. Linda, too. Mm. Welcome, Linda. Eh, Iraeta, ok. Iraeta, and uh, let's see. Ok, 13. Let's see, guys. Let's see. This is just a practice. This es una práctica del simple present and present continuous. Let's go.
Okay, guys, let's see the winners. Linda, Amilcar, very good, Linda. Linda, Amilcar, and Jennifer. Okay, hey, what hey. happened? <laughs> You're on fire, Linda. Mire que se perdió el lugar con Naum, ¿verdad? ¿Qué pasó? What happened, Naum? Teacher, uh, the, the internet maybe, but I get, ah. I get nervous. Yeah, you get <laughs> I, I saw the, the, the board that Linda uh -huh. is in the first play, and I, I, you know, I get, I get a little confused. confused. But I, oh, congrats, congrats for, for the Linda. Okay, congratulations to Linda and yeah. Amilcar, yeah. right? And, and, and Mr. Amilcar too. Mr. Amilcar took advantage. And, and, and all that we tried to to do the to get the first play in the in the <laughs> in that activity. Yeah, I see. And Jennifer, you got the third place. Congratulations, Jennifer. You were very at the bottom, right? Thank but you. you see, very very good, Jennifer. Congratulations. Okay, the next time maybe we are going to change the winners right congratulations to the ones that got the places and the others to right congratulations okay guys let's go over the lesson and uh okay there it is so um we were discussing about the wh questions right vamos a discutir ese día vamos a aprender acerca cómo hacer las wh questions utilizando el present progressive. But first, guys, let me ask you. Let's see, Hugo Ayala, tell me what events are taking place at your work these days? What are some of the events, let's say? Hello, Hugo. Hola, hola, Hugo. Hello, Hugo Ayala. What are some events uh, that are going to take place these days. Hello, sorry hello. teacher. Hola, hola. Yes, I'm listening. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, what are taking oh. oh. Then uh, prepare, uh, I am preparing for, for uh, how do you say Hacienda? Oh, is that the, the Hacienda? Let me uh, check. Oh. I'm going to look for it. Okay. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And what else? Uh, uh, I am checking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Pay to impuestos. Taxes? Taxes? Taxes, okay. I'm preparing for, for, for taxes. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Preparing for the taxes. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, I am I am check a report uh, in the morning. Mm -hmm. uh, I I well, I check I check emails mm -hmm. in the computer mm -hmm. um, every day. Uh, I was I was I am receive receive uh, you are receiving mm -hmm. I are receiving documents for uh, of of other department mm -hmm. uh, um I am I am assist I am assistant I am my assistant a meeting with my boss okay you are going to attend a meeting with your boss well, boss, huh? that's it. Okay, that's it. Okay, so uh, let's see. Uh, in your case, let's see. Naum Hernandez, tell me where are uh, some of the events are going to take place? Are taking place? Where is that in your office? Is that, uh, for example, out of the office or where? Or for example, in another country, right? Uh, okay, in another country. Yeah, I mean, for example, the activities or events your company is having. Ah, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, well, uh, I work for a, a company that they 
they made some some different kind of of food mm -hmm. like traditional food traditional food that they export to to USA okay and that and they they sell to liquor mm -hmm. in all 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 Salvador you know that yeah with okay. different 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 brain mm -hmm. like Jack Daniel Bacardi all that okay interesting and they, uh -huh, and they well we we try to focus into to quality mm -hmm. and solvent that the the client needs you know okay yeah okay uh, interesting maybe. okay La, that is like okay. what you do in your job right okay very good okay uh, carlos okay. tell me uh, who is organizing the meetings let's say or the events who is the person responsible for organizing the meetings the meetings in your case or the events ¿Quién es el responsable de organizar? Yes, o quién las está organizando? ¿Quién es el que está organizando los eventos? Is that, for example, your boss? Is that, for example, you? I don't know, maybe is a secretary, for example? Who is organizing the events, Carlos? Eh, normally, sí, ¿verdad? Normalmente. Yes. Uh, the secretary of um, Recursos Humanos. Human Resources, okay. Recursos Humanos. Human Resources. Uh, uh -huh. Human Resources. Uh -huh. And they uh, are the responsibility is the seven. Uh -huh. uh, and always uh, inform, inform, not inform. Uh, yes, they always inform you. Inform you. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay, that's it. Oh, Very no. good. Okay, thank you, Carlos. That is going to be the information. Okay, let's have uh, this conversation, guys. So I will ask, voy a pedirles que leamos la siguiente. A dialogue, right? Conversation, and then we can practice. Okay, who wants to read, guys? Who wants to practice? Who says me, guys? Who says me? Who wants to practice? Me. Okay, Amilcar. Okay, hello, Good. Amilcar. Okay, you, Amilcar, are going to be Rita, Oseba Rita, and I'm going to be Luis. Okay, Amilcar, ready? Ready. Rita, Luis, good afternoon. This is Rita, the new secretary. I just want to comfort some information. Hey, Rita, sure, tell me. I want to know who are attending the annual conference this year and we is it talking place? Okay, well, the I staff is attending and the conference is taking place in the great room. Rita, by the way, when are the materials arriving? Do you know? Got it. Yes. They are arriving on Friday morning. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Let's continue. Let's see. Thank you, uh, Amilcar. George, you're going to be Rita and um, let's see and Margot. Hola, Margot. Hi. Okay. Usted va a ser Luis. Is that okay, Margot? Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay. I am Rita. Yes. Okay. Luis, good afternoon. Mm -hmm. This is Rita, the new secretary. I just want to confer some information. Hi, Rita. Sure, they me. I want to know who are attending the annual conference this year and where is it a taking place? Well, they eat 
staff is attending an and they conference is taking <coughs> place in the in the great room Rita with they why when are they material ever do you come? Got it. Yes, they are ribbon of Friday morning. Okay, thank you guys. All right. Repeat, please, oh. after just. Repeat, guys. Just. 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 Repeat, please. Just. 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 Tenemos que ser bien eh, los sonidos. Uh, just one, no, two, no one, es two, just, two. just. Yeah. Es con okay. el sonido yeah. de la T. Just. Yeah. Repeat, guys, just. please. Yeah. One more time. Just. Perfect. Okay. Tenemos el siguiente. Sure. 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 Very good. Sure. Siguiente, IT, IT. IT. Tenemos el siguiente, by the way. By, by, the, by the way. By the way, perfect, by the way. perfect. Okay. Tenemos el siguiente verbo, arriving. Arriving. Ok, very arriving. good. Arriving. Ok. ¿Alguna duda, guys? ¿Alguna duda? ¿Any doubt about the words? The moment, no. No. Thank you. What stands for IT? What, what is the significado of IT, guys? Information technology. Exactly. ¿Quiénes usan ese término, por ejemplo, en sus empresas? How many of you use this term in your Me. companies? Do you use it? Yes. Okay, interesting. In so the... you work with, with computers. Uh, yeah, my team, informatics. My team uh, working in the IT, IT group. Mm -hmm. in my position is system administrator. Ah, okay. So we are talking with uh, the big boss here, right? Yes. <laughs> with computers, right? Right. Okay, that's great. Okay, we have here different uh, what careers, right? Different professions. Okay, uh, tenemos la siguiente, by the way, by the way. What is the meaning of by the way, guys? A propósito. Okay, o oh, por cierto, también. A propósito o oh, por cierto. También esto muchos adolescentes lo ocupan bastante cuando están en, mandando eh, mensajes de texto. También lo podemos, lo van a encontrar bastante en los mensajes de texto como de esta forma. By the way, de esta forma. Les comparto en el chat. By the way. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cuando, por ejemplo, estamos en el WhatsApp, usted puede decir, teacher, BTW, by the way, que eso significa. Ok, eh, no sé, ¿alguna otra palabra, guys? ¿Alguna otra palabra? ¿Any new word? No, ok, let's continue, let's continue. Teacher, uh -huh. this is Rita, ¿eso cómo se entiende? Ok, ella es, es Rita. Ella es Rita. Así. Eh, pero en este caso es como que Rita se está, se está presentando o se está identificando okay, que ella Luis... está hablando. Ok, tenemos Luis, good afternoon, this is Rita. Eh, Luis, ¿verdad? Se este, este está presentando como que yo soy Rita. Ajá. Uh -huh. this, this is Rita, Rita. the new secretary. Esta yes. es Rita, aquí sería algo así. Ah, sí, sí, exacto. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok, let's continue, guys, let's continue. Ok, let's see. Ok, use the conversation about to, to help yourself. Ok, ¿cuáles palabras podemos agregar en esta primera sección, guys? ¿Qué palabras podemos utilizar? When. When, tenemos exacto, the first one that is when, right? The second one, guys, ¿cuál es the second one? Who. Ok, tenemos when, who, who. Bien, cool. And the third one? Where. Ok, where, right? Where. where, muy bien. Where. Ok, ahí estamos, las, eh, estamos utilizando las WH questions. There we are using the WH questions, right? So you see that this topic is gonna, is not going to be difficult at all. Ok. Ok, vamos a hacer entonces este exercise, guys. You're going to watch the video, 
y necesito and I need you to write five activities that the video presents. Ok, vamos a escribir cinco actividades que presentan en el video. Ok, ready guys? Ok, let me see if I can share the, the, the video here for para que lo podamos ver juntos together. Ok, será una vez guys, así que les voy a pedir que eh, estemos listos. Get ready, ok guys? Let me see if I can share this. Oh, no, no. Okay, let's see if I can do this quickly. Okay, let's see. There it is. There it is, please. Okay, so. Ready, guys? Okay, let me know if you are ready. Okay, let's see. Hello. Hi, how are you? I'm good, what's up? We just have to meet. I have an important thing I need to tell you about. Oh, really? When are you free? Let me think. Well, I'm having lunch with an important client on Monday. Maybe later in the evening? How about Tuesday? I'm taking a day off then, so I have lots of time. Well, maybe. Oh, no, I can't. I'm meeting Tom for lunch, and also I'm having a meeting with my boss. I'll be busy. I can't meet you on Wednesday. I have other plans. Okay, and what are you doing on Thursday? I'm picking up kids from school at 3 p.m. And what are your plans? Well, let's see. I have yoga in the morning. I'm picking up my laundry at 1.30. Then I'm visiting my parents at 2.30. So why don't we meet later in the afternoon, say 4 or 5? Perfect. Let's meet in our favorite cafe. It's a deal. We're meeting at 5 p.m. at Jeff's Cafe. See ya. See ya. Bye. See ya. Okay. Did you copy the sentences, guys? Sí, ya, ok. Esa es otra forma, right? Pero eso es más informal, al final lo dicen. Sí, ya, sí, ya. Es como decir, sí, yo. Ok, so, uh, one more time, guys, una vez más, yes? Please. Ok, perfect. Hello. Hi, how are you? I'm good, what's up? We just have to meet. I have an important thing I need to tell you about. Oh really? When are you free? Let me think. Well, I'm having lunch with an important client on Monday. Maybe later in the evening? How about Tuesday? I'm taking a day off then, so I have lots of time. Well, maybe. Oh no, I can't. I'm meeting Tom for lunch, and also I'm having a meeting with my boss. I'll be busy. I can't meet you on Wednesday. I have other plans. Okay, and what are you doing on Thursday? I'm picking up kids from school at 3 p.m. And what are your plans? Well, let's see. I have yoga in the morning. I'm picking up my laundry at 1.30. Then I'm visiting my parents at 
So why don't we meet later in the afternoon? Say four or five. Perfect. Let's meet in our favorite cafe. It's a deal. We're meeting at 5 p.m. at Jeff's Cafe. See ya. See ya. Bye. Okay. Now, guys, how many sentences do you have? ¿Cuántas oraciones pudimos copiar, guys? Two, three, how many? What are some of the activities that they mentioned? ¿Cuáles son algunas actividades, guys? Yes. Hello, hello. Okay, teacher. Yes, yes, hello. Mm -hmm. uh, no, it's okay. Okay, go ahead, please. Okay, uh, yes. but uh, the first time that you share the video, there is no description, but the second time that you, you, you help us with the description, but mm -hmm. uh, I, there are a lot of activities that, that, that they want to, to do. Mm -hmm. First, she is talking with another girl that maybe is a secretary, mm -hmm. and she said that she want to talk with. She she said that she want to to talk with her. Mm -hmm. I don't know what topic they, they are going to to mm -hmm. talk, and she said that they have to have a meeting, and they they are going to meet in a cafeteria. On the cafe, I guess. Yes, cafe. Uh, mm -hmm. they, and some girl said that she had to visit her parents. And she, the secretary said that she has to be with a meeting with her boss. Mm -hmm. And the other partner we are going to share with us. Thank you. <laughs> a milker once, right? Okay, let's I go. Guess, of course. <laughs> okay, let's go, Amilcar. Tell us. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no problem. Go ahead. Well, I listen in the events mm -hmm. that girls visit parents, mirroring your boss in the lunch. Mm -hmm. How lunch Monday just say saying mm -hmm. picking picking my song at the school. I don't understand. Very well. Okay, picking it is like when you va a traer, when you go and take your children. Ah, okay, picking, mm -hmm. picking, okay. picking, picking. Uh, to visit the laundry too. Laundry, laundry, it is like when you take your clothes to the laundry, cuando llevamos yeah, yes. la ropa. Okay. Mm -hmm. Entonces dijo que llevaría su ropa o iría a la, a la, a, a la, a la lavandería. A la laundry. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, laundry, okay, very good. Alguna otra idea, guys? Any other idea about the video that you want to add? No? No? Yes? Oh. Um, I don't have the, um, exactly the sentence, mm -hmm. but the, um, the, the women's, uh, like a mm -hmm. both are secretary, mm -hmm. they're talking about um, trying to get the dye day for it together yeah but but they both are very busy mm -hmm. um the secretary have a, a meeting mm -hmm. and and when the secretary have time the other okay. lady don't have doesn't, doesn't have, have. Mm -hmm. and because they, they have a lot of activities to do. Mm -hmm. But finally, I think they they get that. They, that's they, it. they got an arrangement, right? They got an arrange, arrangement. Okay. okay. Thank you, eh, Amelina. Very good. So guys, that was just a practice. I shared with you the link for you to see the video again and to identify some of the activities. Okay, tenemos entonces las WH questions que ya las estudiamos, but it is good to remember, right? Tenemos what, eh, que significa qué, when, cuándo, where, dónde, which, cuál o cuáles, 
who, quién o quiénes, why, lo utilizamos en pregunta, y sería por qué, ¿verdad? ¿Por qué estás triste? Por ejemplo, why are you, uh, why are you so sad? Why? Y siempre cuando tengamos el why, siempre, guys, cuando tengamos el why, vamos a responder con un, ¿cuál es la respuesta que tenemos que dar? Vamos a utilizar el because. Because. Because, because right. En la forma así que ustedes lo van a escuchar en, de la, en la calle, vamos, pueden utilizar cause. También, guys, existe otra forma. Ese es más que todo en las canciones. Ellos dicen de esta forma, cause, cause. También lo mencionan y lo van a ver bastante. Tenemos entonces how many y tenemos how much, ¿verdad? How many, ¿cuántos? Cuando los utilizamos con palabras contables. Y how much con incontables, que ya estudiamos ese tema. How, cómo, y what kind, qué tipo también. Tenemos otras como what time, eh, what, y de esas otras eh, podemos agregar más. ¿Ok? Questions, guys, about the WH questions. Questions? Do you want me to share this in the chat group? Quieren, eh, no sé si me, quieren que les comparta esta imagen en el grupo de WhatsApp? Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. I'm going to share it now for you to have it. Okay, give me just a moment. Teacher. Yes. What kind? La última se puede ocupar para cualquier cosa. What kind? What kind? What kind? Ah, ese sería qué tipo de, por ejemplo, what type of food or what kind of food do you like? Dependiendo okay. de, lo, de la pregunta, de lo que usted quiera eh, saber, ¿verdad? Okay, por ejemplo, what kind of uh, movies do you like? ¿Qué tipo de películas okay. te gusta? Uh -huh. y, no se y no se podría decir what kind the way person. Do you like? Okay, what, okay, repeat please, Amilcar. What kind? What kind? Mm -hmm. uh, the way person do you like? The way person. What can you tell me that in Spanish, please? ¿Qué clase de personas te, gust te gustan o, o algo así? Oh, yes. What kind? What type? Yeah. Two. What type? What type of okay. persons? What type of person do you like? What type of persons do you like? Or what type of movies too, right? Right? What kind of movies too? Okay. Okay, there it is. Let's continue, guys. Let's continue. And uh, so here we, here we are. So guys, we are going to practice. Vamos a practicar. ¿Y qué vamos a hacer? Vamos a identificar qué tipo de WH questions vamos a utilizar de acuerdo a la pregunta que tenemos. Hay unos tiempos que no los hemos estudiado, así que esos los podemos dejar, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, la número dos, este tiempo no lo hemos estudiado, pero si lo podemos hacer, está bien. ¿Ok? Ok, les comparto entonces el documento por WhatsApp y lo vamos a trabajar in pairs. Let's see, solo vamos a escribir la WH question y vamos a practicarlas con sus compañeros una vez ya tengamos las preguntas. Okay, once you enter this, you are going to use the question to ask your classmates. Ok, let's go. No sé si hay dudas, guys. Questions? Questions? No, teacher. No questions. Okay, let's go. Se los comparto en el grupo de WhatsApp. Okay, let's go, guys. Okay.
Okay, let's go guys to the what to the breakout rooms, please. Okay, there it is. Okay, Alejandra and Nancy, Vanessa. Okay, questions? Vanessa, ¿cómo vamos, Vanessa? Hello? Okay, let's see. Alejandra, questions, Alejandra? There. Okay, questions, Jennifer and Beverly, no questions? Um, quizás estoy confundida con el, eh, how, how, el number two. Uh -huh, number two. Bien, esa les decía que la podemos dejar porque es un tense que no lo hemos visto. Entonces esa la podemos dejar. Pero, pero es how long? How long, how long? Sí, ahí sí sería how long have you lived there? ¿Por cuánto tiempo Por cuánto has vivido tiempo. ahí? Uh -huh. okay. Okay, vamos a hacer el intento, pues. Yes, yes, de hecho ya lo hicimos, así que ya lo hicimos bien. Pero esa no es necesario contestarla porque no hemos visto ese tense ahorita. Ok, Jennifer. Vamos, gracias, teacher. Ok, you're welcome. El WH, Ajá, exacto. Ok. La primera dice, eh, do you like? Where, where, where do you live? Where do you live? Yes. Ponemos esa como en la primera. ¿Están de acuerdo todos? Yes. Ok. Where where do you live? ¿Dónde, ¿Dónde tú vives? Uh -huh. Ok. La, okay. la otra dice... Guys, hello, hello. Hello, hello teacher. Okay, just one thing, guys, que estaba escuchando. El verbo, yes. okay, el verbo es live, ¿verdad? Live. Live, no, live. Mm, cuando vives. decimos mm, live, mm, se ha fijado en Facebook, que a veces aparece si estamos en Facebook Live, ahí sí, ¿verdad? Porque estamos en mm. vivo. Pero en este caso el verbo es live, live. Okay? Live. Okay, perfect. Leave. Leave. Okay. Uh -huh. Perfect. Leave. Leave. Let's continue. Okay. Very good. Whoa. Daily. Hola, hola, Daily. Hola, hola, Taku. Ah, no, Daily. ¿Qué vamos a hacer con usted? <laughs> ¿Con quién estaba trabajando, Daily? Con. Ay. No es con Jennifer, no. No, con un muchacho que anda, sale con una camisa celeste. ¿Con Naum? Naum, no. No, don Naum, no. Sí creo que él era. Veamos. 
Daily, Daily. No, 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 no me encuentro. La aún está con Alejandra. Cinco. Grupo 5. En el pero... grupo 5. Vaya, está bien. Ahorita la muevo entonces para el grupo 5. Ok, let's go, Daily. Nancy, Alejandra, questions, ladies, Alejandra. Hola, hola. Hola, teacher. Ay, muy bien, lo siento. Este, la, la voy a enviar nuevamente con el grupo, ok, eh, Alejandra. Ok. Ok. okay. Vamos. Y okay, le voy a cambiar. Ay. Veamos. ¿Con quién estaba? Alejandra, ¿con quién? ¿En qué grupo estaba, Alejandra? Alejandra. Es que no, no, no logré darle a aceptar. Vaya, está bien, la, la voy a enviar nuevamente, ¿ok? Alejandra. Ay, qué difícil, permítame. Ahí está. Ok, Alejandra, let's go. Let's see, Alejandra. Ok, there it is, there it is. Nancy, Nancy, ¿cómo vamos, Nancy? Questions. Hello, Nancy. Hola, hola. Ok, let's continue. The task, Nancy, is in the WhatsApp group. Ahí tenemos la tarea en el grupo de WhatsApp. Ok, Nancy. Sí. Ah, ok. Hello, ladies, questions? Do you have questions? Yes, uh, number two. Number two. Um, yes, um, I think it's... Uh, um, I don't know if... In this case, in that case, Emelina, we can mm -hmm. keep that part because we haven't studied that tense. No hemos estudiado ese tense, yeah. Podemos dejar esa pregunta, ¿ok, okay. Emelina? Ok, thank you. Thank ok, pero si no, si la queremos responder, vamos a utilizar how long. How long es una WH how questions long. también, que significa por cuánto yeah. tiempo. Ok. Por cuánto, ok. So, let's... Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. What is what is seven? Uh, what it's uh, and the seven is your birthday? Uh, one who, who, when, or where? Uh, where, when, when, when is your birthday? When, when, is when, birthday? when, 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 Siete sería Lily B. Uh -huh. well, number eight. Do you do you do and you ah, do you do? What se me traba la lengua últimamente. <laughs> What do you do on your birthday? Birthday. ¿Qué haces en tu cumpleaños? What oh, sí. do you? What? Lily B sería entonces, what? Lily B. Porque okay. due de hacer, ¿verdad? De hacer. Ok. What? Number nine. Are you hobbits? Are you hobbits? What are you hobbits? So what? what? Number. What? Ah, Lily A. A, B, C, A. Así sería. A. ¿Cuál es? No es Wish. Which, which. which are you hobbits? Which, which is cuál? Hey, hello, which. hello, which. Carlos which. and George. Hello. Okay, hello. I'm just going to interrupt you. No el problem. Caso, 
the in the case of which and what, right? Uh -huh. Aquí mencionaron which and what. Okay, which vamos a utilizar cuando tengamos como dos sujetos. Por ejemplo, ¿cuál es tu actividad favorita? ¿Nadar o cantar? Tenemos dos opciones. Okay. Entonces ahí vamos a utilizar which. En este caso vamos a utilizar what. What. Okay, what. Estás preguntando cuál es tu hobby. ¿Cuáles son tus hobbies? ¿Cuáles son tus hobbies? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What are your hobbies? What, ok. okay. And number nine is, ah, thank yeah. you. You're Teacher. welcome. Two usuario, two usuario de in Monday. Hola. Hola. Hello. Vaya, vamos oh. por la. For the number of teacher. Uh -huh. Yes, tell me. Uh, I don't know if the, if the picture has some problem because we uh, we uh, we can. You can see the answers, okay. you know. Okay. Okay. For, yes. For example, no, uh, picture number one, number nine. Picture number nine. Nine nine. Maybe because. Maybe, I guess it is because maybe you open with a, I don't know if a version of the Word document. Uh-huh, that's, that's it. Maybe that, that's but the... We, but we are, to, we are trying to, to, to give, give the, the correct answer about that. Okay, you can check them there. Ah, yes. Ah, pues la mía no cargó. Okay, teacher, I'm sorry for the check, yes. No, no, no problem, no problem. Okay. Okay, you can take but a what? screenshot if you want, and then you can complete the, the questions. Okay, teacher, thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Did you okay. take the screenshot? Yes. Okay, daily, okay, daily, let's go. Para ver las primeras. Vale, las primeras, okay, ahí está. Hasta ahí llega. Esa ya está. Esa creo que me falta. Permítame. Ok, no problem, Daily. Hoy sí. Ok, let's continue, let's continue. Ok, yeah. let's practice the first one. I want to listen you speaking. Ok, now you're going to ask Daily and she's going to give you her information, ok? Ok, no? Uh, I'm going to... Ok. Mm -hmm. uh, daily. Manda? Where do you live? Where do you live? Where do you live? Uh, mm -hmm. okay. Where do you live, uh, Daily? ¿Dónde vive? Where do you live? I live. Um, I am. Uh, I am Aguachapam. Okay, you are in Aguachapam. So I you live are, in Aguachapam. Ah, uh, you live in Aguachapam. Okay, uh -huh. very good. Vamos con la número tres now. Let's go with number three. Porque la dos no no hemos estudiado ese ese tense. Okay, no hemos estudiado ese tema. Uh -huh. Okay. Number three, please. Uh, oh. Who? Okay, okay, okay. Uh -huh. Who do you live with? Okay, who do you live who? with? With. Mm -hmm. Okay, Daily, ¿con quién es vive, Daily? Who do you live with? Um, don't, um, what is it? Number three, number three. La tri, uh -huh. mm -hmm. um, con, eh, quiero ver. With mm -hmm. my, with my eh, hijos, ¿cómo se dice? Okay, with my uh, son, with my son. I am, I am, mom. Okay, with my son and mom. Yes, perfect. Ahora usted, Daily, le hace la pregunta cuatro a Naum, please. Um, la cuatro. La cuatro, yes. How much 
people are there in your family? Mm -hmm. No. Okay, in my family, uh, we are like 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 twenty five persons, you know. Twenty five persons, a lot. Yeah. Twenty. But but no, but but we don't <laughs> we don't live together, teacher. You know. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Okay. But we. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I know. I was going to say, guys, que en este caso cuando tengamos people, como son es una palabra contable, vamos a oh, utilizar. Okay. How many, okay? Uh, okay? How many people are there in your family? Okay. Okay. Okay? How many people? Okay, guys, eso es lo que vamos a hacer. Eh, terminamos de las WH questions y luego usted tiene que preguntarle a su compañero. Okay, teacher. Okay, perfect. Okay. Continue. Let's continue. Daily? ¿Estamos bien en daily? Yes. yes. Okay, <laughs> perfect. <laughs> Let's continue. Hello, guys. Questions? Um, la, la que tenía la duda, Walter. Yo no me acuerdo qué número era. Era la, 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 la 9, de... ¿no? Ajá, la 9. Yes. 9, 9, it says. Okay. ¿Cuál es, cuál estamos, es la que says? Estábamos con el dilema. Eh, pusimos eh, what. What are your hobby? ¿Cuál es tu hobby? Uh -huh. Pero uno decía que cabía la posibilidad de How many are your hobbies? ¿Cuántos son tus hobbies? Entonces quedamos así como que uh -huh. como que las dos pudiesen aplicar uh -huh. o en teoría las dos pudiesen ser correctas dependiendo de la situación. De la situación. No sé, no sé si hay una más indicada o se pudiese usar cualquiera de las dos. Vale, tenemos... Can you repeat, please, the, the sentence? Can you repeat the sentence? What, what are your hobbies? Your hobbies. Bien. Tenemos la duda si era con how many o, how, o what, ¿verdad? What, ajá. Uh -huh. En este caso, siempre, uh, la mayoría de veces, cuando tengamos how many, le va a seguir una palabra, un noun. Por ejemplo, how many Hobbies do you have? Mm. Tenemos el noun, hobbies. Entonces, yo les pregunto, ¿podemos utilizar how many en esta? No. 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 Entonces, it's going to be? What are you? What? What are your hobbies? What? Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's continue. ¿Alguna otra duda, guys? Any other question? Uh, Well, are you, eh, yo sé que este no lo hemos visto, pero nosotros pensamos que la correcta sería how talk. ¿En cuál? What, what, what number? Eh, 12. Number 12. Ok. Uh -huh. How tall are you? How tall are you? Excellent. That's the one. Yes. How tall are you? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay. Thank you, okay. teacher. Okay, you're welcome. Let's continue. Um, salió en este mes de junio. Bueno, ya no. me están <laughs> Hello, guys. Hello. Hello, questions? Do you have questions? Did you finish? Yes. Yes? Yes. 
Okay, can you share with me, please? Can you share with me your answers? Hmm. Podemos compartir, guys, please? Your answers? Um. Okay. Teacher. Mm -hmm. Tell me. Eh, lo, que, lo que compartió en, en WhatsApp no lo puedo ver, fíjese. Mm, pues quizás no, no sé si tenéis instalado Micros, creo que Word. ¿Cómo no? O sea, sí lo puedo ver, perdón. Lo que sucede es de que este. Oh, pero. Uh -huh. Porque. Sí, me... Ah, ok, ya hoy sí. Uh -huh. Ya lo puedo ver, ¿sí? No sé por qué, pero no me deja. Ah, pero. Margot. Hello. No hemos terminado, Margot. No. Ah, no, no, no. Ah, no, no, no. Son 20, Margot. Ah. Yo solo, es que yo solo le tomé un, 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 un screenshot. Ajá. En la que primera te 8. Te Exacto. Sí. Porque ah. eh, no tengo ah. el WhatsApp, eh, el teléfono, lo tengo cargando. Ah, va, está bien, está bien. Ok, let's continue, Milcar. Okay. Ok, okay. <risa> Bueno, entonces, Amilcar, compártalo. <risa> Hello, ladies. Did you finish? Did you finish? Yes. Okay. Can you share, please? Can you share, please? Um, I write in my notebook. Oh, you have it? Okay, I'm going to share mine then. Okay, and you tell me. Okay, so okay. we have number one. What is the answer? Number one is, where do you live? Okay, where do you live? Very good. Number two, Linda? Oh, no, number two is not necessary, but if you have it, you can share with me. Qué linda está su niña. Si es que es una ternurita. <laughs> sí, para. <laughs> ok, linda, let's go. La, bueno, la dos pusimos, uh -huh. how long have you lived there? Very good. Very good, excellent. Number three. Number three, mm -hmm. who do you live with? Okay, who do you live with? Excellent. Number four. Number four, how many people are there in your family? Perfect, Linda. Okay, I, I don't know if you can help me, Silva, with num Silvana, with number five. Okay. Okay. And number five. Uh... I suppose that I, uh, how often do you get to school? How often? Okay, no. In that case, it's going to be, how do you get to school? ¿Cómo llegas a la escuela? No. How do you get to school? Wow. Yes. How do you get to the school? How do you get to school? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's continue. Number six. Number six. Is, uh, what's your mother's name? Perfect. Mm -hmm. Number seven. Number seven. Is, what is your birthday? What? When is your birthday? Yes. Mm -hmm. Number eight. Is, uh, is, what do you do on birthday? On your birthday. Okay. Thank you, Silvana. Let's let's go. Let's go, Linda. Yes. Okay, Linda. Let's continue. Number nine, Linda. Hello. 
perdón, tenía... No problem, no problem. Eh, teníamos dudas si podría ser eh, which are your hobbies, porque podría ser, no sé. Podría o, ser, bien. O sería what are your hobbies. Ok. Ah, ok. Tenemos entonces el which, ¿verdad? Ok, el which uh -huh. se utiliza cuando tenemos dos opciones, por ejemplo. Ok, por ejemplo, o oh, which, which is your favorite, which is your favorite hobby? Eh, running or swimming? Cuando tenemos dos opciones. Entonces, en este caso, what is the option? What is the option in that case? Is, is what are your hobbies? What are your hobbies, exactly. Because it is general. Yes. Okay. Let's okay. continue. Thank you. Let's continue, Linda. Okay. okay. Uh, number 10. Mm -hmm. Number 10. Uh, which, mm -hmm. which is your phone number? Okay. Oh, what? What's... What's your phone number? What's your phone number? Yes. Siempre el which tenemos dos opciones, ¿ok? Ok, which is your okay, card, yes. por ejemplo. Which is your card? The blue one, el azul o el rojo. Ok, mm -hmm. what's your phone number? Number okay. 11, Linda. Um, what's your email address? Perfect, number 12. Uh, how tall are you? Are How you? tall are you? Very good, very good. Can you help me with the other, Silvana? 13, please. Está en mute. Estás en mute. Oh, perdón. Oh, oh perdón. No, no yes, tenga pena. Often, okay. How often do you go to the cinema? Okay. 14. Mm -hmm. Mm. What do you usually do on Sunday? Mm -hmm. um, okay, no problem, Silvana. No problem, no problem. Linda, can you help me, please? Yes. Uh, okay, let's which continue. Color, mm -hmm. Which color do you like most? Okay, it sounds red. There green. you have. Yes, there you yes. have, Linda. Okay, which color do you like the most? Red or green, perfect. 16? Mm -hmm. 16, uh, how many teeth do you have? How many teeth do you have? Perfect, ladies. Okay, vamos a terminar entonces en la main room because time is running a lot. Okay, thank you, ladies. Okay. Okay, hello, hello, everybody. So we are going to continue. You are going to help me with this task. Okay, let's see. Emelina, please, number one. What is the answer for number one, Emelina? Um, where do you live? Okay, we have where... Okay, we have a where do you live? Perfect, thank you. Uh, the okay. next one, number three, please. And number three, Amilcar, please, number three. Hmm? Amilcar, Amilcar, hello. Now, now. Yes. Who do you live with? Okay, who do you live with? Very good. Okay, who do you live with? With that's right, that's the answer. Y la número dos, ¿cómo quedaba, teacher? La how número long? dos, how long? How long? How long? How long? How long? Por cuánto tiempo has vivido ahí? Ah, okay. correcto. Sure. Number four, number four. Let's see, Hugo, number four, please, number four. How many people are there in your family? Perfect. How many people are there? In your family. Vamos a utilizar how many porque es 
People es una palabra contable, ¿ok? Countable nouns. Vamos con la number five. Number five, guys. Margot, por favor, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Margot, please. Uh, el five es hot, uh, how hot of day do you get to school? How often do you get to school? Okay, in this case, vamos a ocupar, Marco, how. How. ¿Cómo okay. llegas a la escuela? Por ejemplo, ver, Marco, por sí, carro, sí. por, no sé, por train, by train. Sí, sí. How. How. Okay, okay. ¿qué pasó? ¿Qué pasó? Se me fue. Ahí está. Ahí está. There it is. Okay. Yes, Amil Girl, tell me. Get. Get in introduction is uh, it has tener. different meanings. Meaning, okay. it has okay. different a lot meanings. Muchos significados. Yes, okay. Por ejemplo, I get boring, me aburro rápido y tiene otro significado. I get boring. Escuché, escuché que dijo uh -huh. alguien, I get nervous. Nerv I get nervous, me pongo nervioso sí, también. Uh -huh. Tiene bastante significados. Get. Ok, yes. so, number six. Uh, let's see, let's see, number six. Um, eh, Jorge, please, number six. Number six, Jorge. Ok, number six is what. Okay, we have a what, mm -hmm. right? Sí. What. Oh, I'm sorry, what. What. Yes. What. What's your mother's name? Very good. Number seven. What's your mother's name, eh, Jorge? What's your mother's name? The name I, uh, the, my my mother's mother, name. Mother is Amparo Ramos. Amparo Ramos. Okay. Very good. Let's see. Um, Carlos Bolaños. Number seven. Seven. Mm -hmm. When is your birthday? When is your birthday? Okay, in your case, when is your birthday, Carlos? My birthday is March 10th. It's on March 10th. Okay, thank you, Carlos. The next okay. one, Jennifer, please. Number eight, Jennifer. What do you do on your birthday? Okay. What do you do on your birthday, Jennifer? What do you do on your birthday? Mm, dinner with my parents. Okay. And you have dinner with your parents. Okay. Okay. That's good, right? To be with your family. Okay. Thank you. Beverly, please. Number nine. Number nine, Everly. Beverly. What are your hobbies? Okay. Very good. What are your hobbies? Por ahí me decían que estaban confundidos si era which o si era what. Which lo vamos a utilizar cuando tengamos dos opciones. Ya lo vamos a ver más adelante que hay una pregunta donde usted tiene dos opciones. Ahí vamos a utilizar which. En este caso sería what. Okay. Thank you, Beverly. Okay. Let's see. Uh, Vanessa, Vanessa. Hello, Vanessa. Hello, hello, Vanessa. Hello, teacher. Okay, number 10, please. What's your phone number? Perfect. What's your phone number? What's your phone number, Vanessa? My number phone is uh, seven, mm -hmm. two, three, nine, mm -hmm. two, six, six, nine. Okay, my Thank telephone you, number <laughs> is... <laughs> teacher, teacher, be careful yeah. with, be careful with uh, Amilcar, maybe he get <laughs> her number something, you know. <laughs> okay, did you listen, Amilcar, what he said, <laughs> take care with that. Okay, don't, let's don't continue. Don't worry, don't worry, my, my brother. <laughs> you got it, the number? <laughs> <don't worry>. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> As teacher, as you can see, as you can see, there are another use to, to use to get. Okay, okay, okay. I got it. I got it. Okay, I got it. Okay, let's continue. Let's see. Um, Alejandra, Alejandra, please. What what is that the the WH uh, question there? Mm -hmm. 
¿Qué eh, no, número, teacher? Eleven, eleven, Alejandra. Eleven. Ok, es... Eh, what's your email address? Ok, what's your email address, Alejandra? What's your email address? <laughs> eh, my email address is eh, Ale Ostorga. Uh -huh. No recuerdo cómo se dice arroba. Arroba at. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. At eh, Gmail. Gmail. Eh, punto com. That. Cuando decimos punto, vamos a decir that com. Uh, that. that com. That com. Ok. Thank you, Alejandra. Let's continue with the next one. Daily, please. Number 12. Daily. Uh, how, how are low are mm -hmm. you? How long or how tall? How. Qué tan alto, ¿verdad? How tall. Ok. Vamos a utilizar entonces how tall. Porque si decimos. Uy, ¿qué pasó? ¿Está? Vamos a ocupar qué tan alto eres. Okay, si decimos how long, es como qué tan largo, ¿verdad? Something that it is long. Ok, guys. Les comparto entonces la respuesta de las demás debido al tiempo, porque si no, porque nos hace falta todavía otras actividades. Ok, guys. Ok, let's continue. And uh, I'm going to continue with the lesson that we have. Okay, eso era para que identifiquemos las different WH questions que vamos a utilizar con el present continuous. Ok. La estructura que tenemos que seguir para hacer una WH question usando el presente continuo es la siguiente. The first thing that we have to add is the WH question. Primero, WH question. Luego vamos a agregar el verbo to be de acuerdo al sujeto que tengamos, más el verbo en ing. Ok, por ejemplo, why is he meeting the new people today? Tenemos la WH question, el verbo to be de acuerdo al sujeto, que sería he, y el verbo with ing. Luego tenemos el complemento. Tenemos entonces el complemento, complement, tenemos entonces the verb in ing, verb in ing, tenemos entonces el sujeto, tenemos el sujeto, the subject, y tenemos entonces the verb to be de acuerdo al subject. Uh -huh. Questions, guys? Questions about the structure, for example, the, the structure questions? Teacher, lo puede repetir? Yes, yes, sure, sure. Ok, para hacer las preguntas utilizando WH questions, vamos a seguir la estructura. Lo primero que vamos a escribir es la WH question, la que hemos estudiado, como how, when, what, eh, How, how, how often, etc. Después de describir el WH question, vamos a utilizar el verbo to be de acuerdo al sujeto. Por ejemplo, en este caso estamos utilizando he, vamos a escribir is. No. Más el verbo con ing, ing. No. Segura. Segura. Ok. Ok. Questions. Teacher. Hola, yes. For example, in the letter A, mm -hmm. why is he meeting? Mm -hmm. Is the WA question? And then, ah. and, 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 uh, how do you? No, no. Perdón, perdón. Este guys, microphone, please. Can you help with the microphone? Okay, okay. Let's go. Yes, continue, Milka. Continue, please. And then, and. Why is she meeting? Is he meeting? ¿Por qué se está reuniendo? Esa yes. es la, la, la yes. traducción. 
Why is he meeting the new people today? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is it translation, Amilcar? Okay, translation. Yeah. The translation. Mm -hmm. Okay, no questions, guys? No question? Okay, tenemos entonces el siguiente ejemplo. When is the new office launching? Acá tenemos the new office, que sería el sujeto, ¿verdad? When is the new office launching? Entonces, como es singular, vamos a utilizar is. Is, es sing, singular, right? Veamos el siguiente. Where is your boss having the annual meeting? Como estamos hablando de he, ¿verdad? Que es el boss, vamos a utilizar is. Ok, questions, guys? No le entendí mucho a eso, Tiche, donde no hay... Un sujeto específico. Ah, donde no hay un sujeto específico. Va, está bien. No problem. Ok. Eh, por ejemplo, de acuerdo al sujeto, vamos a utilizar el verbo to be. Tenemos, por ejemplo, mother. Mother, por ejemplo, el sujeto mother. Por ejemplo, what. ¿Qué voy a utilizar si estoy hablando de mother? ¿Qué verbo to be voy a utilizar? Has. She. ¿Qué verbo to be, guys? Para madre. Is. 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 Únicamente vamos a utilizar el verbo to be. Am, is o are. Solo estos tres, guys. ¿Ok? Nada más. Nada de has, nada de do, nada de does. No. Solo el verbo to be. Para preguntas. What is your mother doing next Monday. Ok, verbo to be. De acuerdo al sujeto que tengamos. Ok, questions. Uh -huh. O sea que de new office estamos como hablando de eso, digamos. Exacto. De Exacto, estamos ah, okay. hablando de la nueva oficina. Ok. Uh -huh. Okay, questions, guys. Questions, ask. You can ask, guys. Teacher. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. Um, um, ¿Cuál sería la traducción para la, el ejemplo número uno? Okay, ¿por qué él? se está encontrando o reuniendo con las nuevas personas de este, en este día. ¿Por qué él se está con el is, verdad? Is, meeting, reuniendo con las nuevas personas. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, ok. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Okay, no question, guys. Question. Entonces, teacher, mm -hmm. the translation, the translation, the number three, where is your boss having? Mm -hmm. ¿Dónde tendrá? O, ¿dónde va a tener él la okay. reunión anual? Ok, ok. En el caso de futuro, ¿verdad? Yes, yes, yes. Uh -huh. Yes, yes, no questions, guys. Recordemos que puede tener dos traducciones. Por ejemplo, cuando estamos hablando de futuro, va a tener, va a comenzar. En el caso que estemos hablando de una acción en este momento, eh, sería como qué está haciendo él, qué está comiendo. Ok, that is like the, the translation that we can have. Uh -huh. En la number three, no, pode, no podemos decir um, dónde está teniendo la reunión anual. ¿Dónde está no. la reunión anual? 
como no nos indica que sea futuro, fíjense. Entonces, también podemos tomarla así. Where is your boss having the annual meeting? También. Yes, it's a, it's but a good I, one. But I understand the annual meeting is not to come. Ya, yeah, pero no nos está dando como un tiempo a futuro. No nos está diciendo a Milcar. Por ejemplo, las future expression que podemos utilizar. Next week, next year, next Monday. Ah, ok, but, uh -huh. uh, pero por simple inspección se mira que aún no ha llegado, al menos así lo entendí uh -huh. desde el inicio. Yes, hello. Porque Is está speaking? en un indefinido, ¿cómo se dice? Indefin tiempo indefinido. Indefinite time. Uh -huh. Indefinite time, ok. Uh -huh. Está en un tiempo indef indefinido, solo que aún no ha llegado. Oh, let's see, where is your boss having the annual meeting? No, I, I, I would go with Emelina's option. Seria, for me, it is, it is, it sounds like a more natural, that one. The one that said Emelina. Mm -hmm. But okay. guys, in this guys, in this case, guys, I don't really recommend you that you translate uh, because you are going to get accustomed to that. So try not to translate too much, guys, because your brain is going to work double. Así que evitemos lo más que podamos de traducir, porque si no, cuando estemos hablando, se nos va a ser más difícil. Yes, so I don't recommend you too much that you translate. Just for you to have an idea, yes. Solo para tener la idea, yes, but not all the time. Okay, let's continue. Questions about about the, the the structure, guys. No questions. Mm -hmm. No questions. Okay. No questions. Let's, let's practice, guys. This is for you to practice mainly. Okay. Okay. Let's see. And uh, what time it is, guys? I'm sorry. Yes, it's we still have time. Okay, so vamos a trabajar. You're going to work in your in your books, guys, in page page 36, activities four and five. Okay, activities four and five. Page 36, activities four and five. Teacher, sorry, 36 dijo. Yes, 36, 36, 36. Okay, page 36, guys. Por favor, revisemos que tengamos los quizzes, guys. Hasta ahorita de esta semana sería el 11, 12 y 13, ¿ok? Que haríamos este día. Okay. No olvidemos completar los quizzes también. Okay, guys, uh, Amilcar, if you can see your WhatsApp group, there you're going to see what Google says about the translation you said. Okay, can you check it, Amilcar? Okay, 
That is what Google says, right? And even Google guys can get some mistakes, right? No nos confiemos de Google tampoco, guys, from Google Translator. Okay, it, it has different translations, some of the sentences. Okay, let's continue, guys. Let's continue. We still have some minutes. Teacher. Yes, Amilcar. I don't I don't have a uh, page 36. Okay, you don't have? Do you want me to share with you? Yes. Okay, no problem. I'm gonna share it in the WhatsApp group. Thanks. The activities, okay? Okay, teacher. Hey guys, while you are working, I'm going to pass the attendance. Don't forget to say present. Okay, guys? Mientras trabajamos, paso la asistencia. Okay, guys? Amilcar, yes. Yes, teacher, present. Okay, Angela. Angela. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's see. Uh, daily, daily. Present. Okay, thank you, Daily. Eloisa Beatriz. Eloisa Beatriz. Eloisa, no? Let's see, Hugo Alexander. Hugo Alexander. Hugo Alexander. No? Okay, let's see. Hugo Ernesto Ayala. Hugo Ernesto Ayala. Present teacher. Okay, thank you, Hugo. Um, Jose Naum Palacios, Jose Naum Palacios, Jose Naum Palacios, hello, Mabel Hernández, Mabel Hernández, Mabel, eh, Oscar Armando, Oscar Armando, Oscar Armando, Linda Vanessa, Present. I can't okay. teacher. Okay. Who says that? Quien, who is speaking, guys? Who is speaking? Eh, Mabel, es que no me, estaba, no me agarraba el, el micrófono. Ah, va, está bien, Mabel. Let me check, please. Okay, yes, I got it. I got it, Mabel. No, no problem. Gracias. Okay, Mabel. Let's continue, guys. Naum, did you finish now? Yes or no? Yes, okay. yes So you can share with me your activities. Tell me, please. Okay. Hmm? Uh, activity number four. Yeah, please. And num number two. Four. Yeah. Oh, yes, number two. Yeah. Okay. How is he diverted? Can you help me with the, that pronunciation, please? Dividing. 
dividing the groups. Mm -hmm. When is she handing the checks? Mm -hmm. um, which factory is your boss visit, visit, visiting, visiting this month? Mm -hmm. Uh, why is the new secretary working the next Saturday? Okay, so I'm gonna ask you, what company are you working for now? Um, Cria Inversiones. Cria Invers Cria? Cria Inversiones. Oh, Cria Inver Inversiones, okay, that's yes. good. How is, for example, divide, how is the company dividing the groups? Okay, and th there are different kind of the departments, you know, that uh, human resource, uh, accounting, auditor, uh, sellers, mm -hmm. uh, marketing, IT department, that you said, mm -hmm. the person who repair the computer, the system. Okay. Um, there are the junta directiva, the main. Okay, they are the main members, let's say, or the staff. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Production, production department, uh -huh. secu security department, uh -huh. transportation department. Okay. Uh, the person who travel to uh, to to USA to make business, you know. Okay. Business. 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 And the telemarketing, telemarketing department. Okay. There are a lot of departments. Oh, that's a lot. That, that must uh -huh. be a, a big company, right? Yep. Okay. Yep. Very good. Okay. Thank you. Now, okay. did you finish the quiz that we have for today? Sure. No, teacher. Not okay. yet. Okay. Okay. Yet. You can finish now. On, okay. Did you finish, Amilcar, or not yet? Not yet. Let's continue. We still have four minutes, guys, okay? Let me know if you have questions. Seguimos con la misma, teacher. Hola, hola. See, if you can finish the quiz, it's okay. 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 Finish, teacher. Okay, did you finish the quiz, Amilcar? Yes. Okay, did you finish the at least the first part, number four? Uh, not yet. This one, Amilka? This one? Number five is, is pen. You can try? Do you want to try? Or do you have it? Number four, number four, I finish. Number four, okay. Tell me, please. Help me. Tell me the answers. Okay. Uh, how often is he dividing the groups? Okay. Uh, how? When, how often? 
Okay. Is he dividing dividing, the dividing, dividing, dividing the groups. Okay, Amilcar, we just have to use, for example, the WH question that appears there. Okay, you, you don't need to add anything else. Okay, Amilcar? So, I how? Okay, not, how not necessary. No tenemos que agregarle how often. Con los que están ahí, esas podemos usar, Amilcar, okay? Ah, uh, okay, pero. Mm -hmm. Están allí. Where is there? Number two, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. How is he dividing the groups? Okay. How is he dividing the groups? Okay. Very good. Okay. Number three. When when is she handing the checks? Very good. Which factory is is your boss visiting this month? Okay, okay. Well, we're gonna stop there, Amilcar, because I don't want to take too much time, guys, and I want to respect your time to sleep. So you can leave the class, and I'm gonna see you tomorrow, guys. Have a nice uh, day and have a good night too. I'm gonna say good. Okay, you too. Thank you so much, guys. Sleep a lot. Thank you. Okay, Thank see you guys. You. See you, Linda. Thank Take you, care. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Take care. See Bye. you. Rest Bye. a lot, Bye. guys. Bye. Rest a lot. See you. Bye-bye. Yes. George. Bye, teacher. Take a big nap, okay? See you, everybody. Okay, see you. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow, guys. See you tomorrow. Have a good day and good night. Thank you so much. See you. Okay. Good see night, you. teacher. Good night. Good night. See you, Beverly. Okay, let's see. Bye bye, Carlos. Bye bye. So, una consulta, teacher. Dígame, Carlos, sí. Perdón, por eso me sacó el, el, el programa, pero por eso voy a ingresar. Este, fíjese que yo el día de ayer no pude uh -huh. estar en la clase y veo que ayer me tocó estar con usted. Me imagino que me va a reprogramar. Fíjese que mmm, voy a ver si, si lo puedo reprogramar, fíjese. Porque, ajá, porque la cuestión es que ya están acomodados los, o al menos que usted quiera cambiar con alguien, ¿verdad? Que alguien le pueda ceder el espacio. Eh, Podemos hacer bueno, eso. Uh -huh. No se preocupe, yo sé que es solo para consultar cómo estamos, cómo nos sentimos y todo. La otra pregunta es, que yo, yo, yo tenía, tengo la duda, uh -huh. sobre los quiz. Uh -huh. ¿Los quiz este, están en, en la plataforma o son algunos que agrega usted? No, no, texto? no, esos, esos son los que da la plataforma, Carlos, son los que tenemos que terminar. Ok. Uh -huh. Son, son las cinco preguntas, ok. Nada más. Okay. Thank you. Bah, you're welcome, Carlos. See you. Ok. Ok, hello, Jennifer. Hola, hola, teacher. Ok. <risa> okay. Eh, perdón por no hacer de la cámara. No, 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 no hay problema, no hay eh, problema, Jennifer. No hay pasó problema. un accidente con mi compu. <risa> ok, no problem, no problem. Ok, Jennifer, tell me, is there, for example, a topic that you want to review? ¿Hay algún tema que queramos revisar, eh, Jennifer? Mm. En específico, veamos. Hold on. Uh -huh. eh, creo que creo que más allá de un tema en específico uh -huh. a mí me cuesta el listening ah, el listening Yo, quizá leyendo, o sea, cuando veo las palabras me voy ubicando uh -huh. pero el listening es mi debilidad uh -huh. cuando usted me da una indicación o sea, tal vez puedo leer una indicación y entenderla mejor que cuando la escucho uh -huh. Vaya, en ese caso, si queremos hacer como unos tips para mejorar el listening, lo principal, Jennifer, es la práctica. El listening solo se obtiene con la práctica, nada más. Uh -huh. Y lo que nada estoy pensando es escuchar algunas canciones Ajá. Que va y ver la, eh, que tengan la, la, la letra. En inglés, español. Ajá. Para que haga cortocircuito el cerebro y, y <risa> que le meta el inglés. Sí. Esa es una buena técnica, la verdad. Escuchar las canciones es una buena técnica. 
pero más que todo, por ejemplo, eh, mirar, por ejemplo, series en inglés. Esa ah. es una buena técnica que le puede ayudar. Quizás no, no empezarlas a verlas todas en inglés, ¿verdad? Porque si no, nos vamos a quedar lo que vamos a perseguir. Pero ver así como videos cortos que a usted le gusten, por ejemplo, si le gusta la moda, no la vea en español, véala en inglés. Ajá, okay. Ajá. Entonces, con pequeños videos así en inglés, usted puede ir leyendo los subtítulos y ahí usted se va a ir familiarizando con eso. Ok, gracias. Una, una duda uh -huh. sí tenía. Sí. Era con, eh, quizás con lo que me estoy confundiendo es uh -huh. cuando veo eh, generalmente en los, en los juegos, si nos referimos a una tercera persona, yo me confundo con el agregarle el S al final al verbo. Uh -huh. Sería, eh, por ejemplo, eh, no sé si está bien. Sí. He run. He. He, oh, he run. Uh -huh. Ella corre. Eh, okay. In the park o oh, on the park. Ah, in the park. Eh, eh, creo que más que ahí, <ríe> ya me están surgiendo las dudas. Tengo dudas con el in, on y at. El at, yo sé que se ocupa para horas, pero el in y el on, uh -huh. para mí el on es sobre, ¿verdad? pero también se le da otro uso. Exacto. Eh, ahí, ahí donde dice, she run in the park, ¿cuándo se le agrega el S al, al verbo? Ahí, la primera, ok, la primera duda eh, era esa, ¿verdad? ¿Cuándo es que se le agrega ese el verbo? Uh -huh. Siempre que estemos hablando, por ejemplo, de ella o de él o de alguna cosa en singular, le vamos a agregar S al verbo. Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, podemos reemplazar she, por ejemplo, por my sister, por ejemplo, my friend, también my cousin, uh -huh. my teacher, por ejemplo, the doctor. Todas esas personas que estemos hablando en singular, vamos a agregarle ese, ese al verbo. Uh -huh. Ok. No sé si ahí eh, vamos bien. Sí, sí, vamos bien. Vaya. Entonces, con lo otro que usted me preguntaba de cuándo utilizar in, on y at. Uh -huh. estas, estas preposiciones la verdad que sí dan un poquito dolor de cabeza pero ya al identificarlas ya usted se da cuenta en qué momento la va a utilizar uh -huh. bien, el y lo vamos a utilizar como para algo más general por ejemplo cuando estamos hablando de, de cosas así como algo más bigger, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. por ejemplo, podemos decir in the, in the mountain in the mountain, yes por ejemplo, in the morning. Por ejemplo, lo podemos utilizar in summer también. Va como con de ciertas expresiones. In the summer. summer. In the summer. summer. Uh -huh. El on lo podemos utilizar, por ejemplo, con los días de la semana. On Monday, on Saturday, on my birthday, por ejemplo. Mi cumpleaños, en una fecha Exacto. en específico. Es en una fecha, exacto, una fecha en específico. En específico. Y digamos, on, on Christmas Day. On Christmas, yes, we have on Christmas Day, yes. Mm, okay. uh -huh. Ya ahí sí me voy ubicando mejor. Exacto. El at también, ¿verdad? Lo podemos utilizar para, para horas y también lo podemos utilizar para dar lugares en específico. Por ejemplo, I am at the Salvador University. Estoy en un lugar en específico, el at. At horas o lugares en específico. ¿Cómo? Very specific places, yes. Muy específico. Y yes. digamos, at the school. At the school, pero por ejemplo. O diría, uh, and the, uh, podría decir, uh, at the at Adventist School. I am uh -huh, in the Adventist school también, ¿verdad? Algo bien específico. Sería in. At. At. I am at the Adventist, Adventist creo que sí es, school. Uh -huh. Ok, lo que voy a hacer es que le voy a compartir esta información para que usted también la pueda eh, estudiar también, ¿verdad? Créame que a veces estos, estas palabras... Son de las que cuestan bastante porque hay ciertas expresiones 
que van acompañadas de, de in, on y at. Uh -huh. okay. Sí, así que no, no se preocupe que esto hasta, hasta nosotros nos cuesta bastante identificar cuándo. Uh -huh. okay. Okay. Sí, no, no son tan... In the morning, in the afternoon, in yes. the summer, in the... In... 100, no, 1,000, 80. Uh -huh. <laughs> y el otro sería in the 1,900. Mm. Ahí lo podemos decir in the 19, también lo podemos leer 19. 19. Solamente así. O 90. Los 90. Mm. In the 90s, 90s también. 90s. Mm, 90s. 90s, en los 90 también. Ok, esa sería, la verdad que el inglés es, desde siempre está lo estudiando, Jennifer, mm -hmm. así que, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> ok, you're welcome, I let you rest, and if you have questions, you can ask me, ok, Jennifer? Thank you. Ok, have a good okay. night, Jennifer, and see you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Good night, Jennifer. Rest a lot. <laughs>